A street in a town near you. One seemingly ordinary house. Two extraordinary men. Their mission? To explore the science behind Hollywood's most outrageous scenes. Fearlessly, they test classic movie moments to breaking point and beyond. Could they actually happen? Or is it just Hollywood science? Our movie has a hard-drinking hero. I'm pretty well pooped out. But you shouldn't drink and drive, especially in the minefield. What's our chance of getting through the minefield? Even money? The next thing you know, you're being chased by the Nazis. God! Our movie is... Ice Cold in Alex. The next drink I have is going to be a lager. Ice cold. There's a little bar in Alex. But before our heroes can enjoy an ice cold beer in Alexandria, they face a bit of an uphill struggle. What's the matter? Is this slope? The wind has blown deep Sandris over it. Maybe we'll have trouble getting her up. It's a challenge so heroic we're going to try it ourselves. It's no good, sir. What do you mean, no good? You're a bloody fine one to talk riding all the way. You told me to drive, sir. It's the engine. It's boiling over. It's heating. And a seized engine won't get us to Alex. If you can't drive it and you can't push it, what can you do? Now, there is a way we might get her up. Wind her up on the starting handle with the plugs out in reverse, lowest gear. It's a long shot, but it could work. But could it really work? Now, this is the bit of the film we're going to put to the test today. You know, getting that army truck up that hill. I mean, what do you reckon, Jonathan, all that cranking business? I love it? this film. It'd be really good to prove it, wouldn't it? Yeah. Now, let's see. Break off. OK. Now, in the olden days, right. cars had crank handles to start them sometimes if right. the starter didn't work. So right. that goes onto the drive shaft. That's going directly onto the drive shaft of the engine and then through the gearbox to the back axle. It's working. Tom! It's working! It's working! So we've got to use the gears and a lot of brute force yeah, yeah. to get this thing up the hill. Absolutely. Now, I know a thing or two about sort of four-wheel drive. I've got a four-wheel drive myself. Right. And uh, I know, in fact, this is an Austin K2 army truck converted to an ambulance. It weighs four tons. Four so they've got a hell of a lot to wind yeah. up there. Yeah. I'm not sure they really could do it. You know, it's pretty tough. So you know about gearboxes? Oh, yeah, all that stuff. Yeah, Excellent. Easy. Well, let's take a little exercise, shall we? So, Jonathan, let's give it a go, then. Where's the ambulance, sir? Well, it's, it's this. <laughs> it's that? Yeah. Well, I know it's not exactly the same, but it's a Morris. It was actually built in the same yeah, year that the film was made, it so like it's, it it's a classic motor. It's got, it's got the crank handle on the front. Oh, yeah. You know, so it's all there. Right. So what we've got to do is put it in reverse, and we can try it out here, because it's not too, too steep a hill. We can see if we just get the basic idea to work. Excellent. All right, Jonathan, you put it in reverse. That's towards you and then down. OK. That's, yep, that's it. Got you it. got it. OK. All right, Jonathan. OK. Handbrake off. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, yeah, it's working. Oh, it's moving. It's working. It's a bit of hard work there. It's very hard work. Of course, in the film, they said that they take the spark plugs out first. I've no idea what they're doing. They tried to explain to me, but I'm hopeless at that sort of thing. If you take the plugs out, there's no resistance. And if you put it a low gear and wind the starting handle, the wheels turn very slowly. Necessary. Right, well, I'm just taking off the spark plugs right. so that when I crank the engine round, right. it doesn't have any compression, because whereas the pistons go up and down, right. they're, they're compressing air, so there's oh. a lot of resistance to it. Right, right, right. So if we take the spark plugs out, which is what they did in the film, oh, I theoretically see. it should be much easier It'll to wind. It'll go around quicker, yeah. Yeah. easier. Yeah. We hope. We hope. Come and help. All right. Now come and watch a miracle. Here we go. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, look at that. It's working. It's working. It's working. We're moving. Oh, yes. Right, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, it works on the flat, but I think we ought to try on the hill next. It's working. Right. 500 turns each and we get to the top. All right. Here we go. Yeah, let off the brake. 
hold on. Oh, oh, we're not in gear. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay, hang on. That's one. <laughs> Two. Three. Four. Jonathan, brakes on. Oh, that's it. I'm finished. Oh, it's knackering. Isn't so, it? what have we done? About 50 feet up a not very steep hill. Yeah. On tarmac on as well. On tarmac. So, we're not yeah, even on tarmac. would have been really Much good. harder, wouldn't it? We're there. We made it. Do you know what I fancy, though? What's that? An ice cold beer. <laughs> I do understand. I can't wind it. I can't wind the car up the hill, and I can't drink all the beer in one go. They were tough in those days. They were tough. Four more, Joe. Here's to you, man. I don't think they could have done five hundred tens. No. Fifty, no. maybe. Oh, God, me. <laughs> <laughs> but we do know one thing. Actually, I've got um, a little demo here. Right. Uh, because you can work out the angle of the sand dune. Oh, uh, right. So let's make our own sand dune out of salt. I mean, salt's not the same as sand, but it shows the principle. Right. Oh, I see. Every time, as you put more in, it isn't going higher and higher. No. It sort of, it's know, all slips, never doesn't it? Before. Yeah. So you get, you're keeping a fairly constant angle. So I don't know what the angle of our road was earlier. It wasn't much. as steep as that, actually. No, no way. Which is slightly worrying, because it means they were going up a much steeper hill. With, a, with a six times the weight. Because mm. basically, they've got to lift four tons the height of that hill. Right. I see, that's effectively what they're doing. They're yeah. About, they're, yes, of course they are, yeah. yeah. And uh, so. they get away with it, of course, because they, um, they can use the gears. Right. So they have to turn the, the gear handle loads and loads of times yeah. and inch their way up. Well, okay. That's a very impressive sand dune you've got there. There's, oh, there's the little throw. Boom, 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 boom. Right. Okay, so there's our, our ambulance. Yeah, that looks about right. If we get a protractor. Put that in there. It's yeah. about 30. Yeah, 32 or something like that, isn't it? Yeah. 32 degrees. Right. Yeah. And that's what would happen with sand. So we know they're probably not going above that. Right. But so so what we got? We've got the steepness yeah. of the hill. Yeah. We've got the fact they're doing it on sand. Yeah. The fact that it's really, really hot. Yes. <laughs> the fact that they've got four tons. But we know that with the gearing, it is possible. Yeah. And yeah. also the gearing on that truck, I think, is lower. So they would actually yeah. have to wind a lot more times. But it'd be easier to do. So it means it would be easier to do each yeah. wind. So what do you reckon? I actually, I actually think it's, I like it. If I your life depends on it, you could do it. Yeah. Yeah. So what would we give it? I'd, I'd nine. Nine? Nine. I'd go yeah. that far. Wow. What about you? What yeah, you I, think, I think seven or eight, definitely. Really? Yeah. Right. No, I think yeah. they would do it. I think they would do yeah. it. They would take, it would just take them all day. It's a long shot, but it could work. And I think we ought to toast their heroic effort. Absolutely. What do you think? Here we go. Cheers to Cheers. Ice Cold and Alex. Yeah. Oh, nice.